school and my brother say my mind and if you don't I give as you receive and your release is sickened. This teaching is the part 163 in the series Christ Forgiveness How to Manifest Immortality Season 2. And today's teaching is God or the Ego and Introduction. Either God or the Ego is insane. If you will examine the evidence on both sides fairly, you will realize this must be true. Neither God nor the Ego proposes a partial thought system. It is internally consistent, but they are diametrically opposed in all respects, so that partial alliance is impossible. Remember too that their results are as different as their foundations, and their fundamentally irreconcilable natures cannot be reconciled by vacillations between them. Nothing alive is fatherless, for life is creation. Therefore, your decision is always an answer to the question, Who is my father? And you will be faithful to the father you chose. Yet, what would you say to someone who believed this question really involves conflict? If you made the ego, how can the ego have made you? The authority problem is still the only source of conflict because the ego was made out of the wish of God's son to father him. The ego then is nothing more than a delusional system in which you made your own father. Make no mistake about this, it sounds insane when it is stated with perfect honesty, but the ego never looks on what it does with perfect honesty. Yet, that is its insane premise which is carefully hidden in the dark cornerstone of its thought system. And either the ego which you made is your father, or its whole thought system will not stand. You make by projection, but God creates by extension. The cornerstone of God's creation is you, for his thought system is light. Remember the rails that are there unseen. The more you approach the center of his thought system, the clearer the light becomes. The closer you come to the ego's thought system, the darker and more obscure becomes the way. Yet even the little spark in your mind is enough to lighten it. Bring this light fearlessly with you and bravely hold it up to the foundation of the ego's thought system. Be willing to judge it with perfect honesty. Open the dark cornerstone of terror to which, on which it rests and bring it out into the light. There you will see that it rested on meaninglessness and that everything of which you have been afraid was based on nothing. My brother, you are part of good and part of me. When you have at last looked at the ego's foundation without shrinking, you will also have looked upon us. I come to you from our Father to offer you everything again. Do not refuse it in order to keep a dark cornerstone hidden, for its protection will not save you. I give you the lamp, and I will go with you. You will not take this journey alone. I will lead you to your true father who has need of you as I have. Will you answer the call of love with joy? <laughs>